What is going on, everybody? My name is Pete, and you guys are watching Paid to Drive and Pay to Drive Vlogs. Hope you guys are doing fantastic out there. If you drive for apps like Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats, or any of the others, you, my friends, are in the right place to stay up to date with what's going on in the gig economy. So get started right now for free. Hit that red subscribe button down below. Turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And if you wouldn't mind, hit that like button down below just lets YouTube know I'm doing a good job in fact leave a comment right now saying liked just so I know you did it and let's jump into it all right drivers and dashers got another interesting email to go over now let me just give a disclaimer as I do on a lot of these videos uh, keep in mind this is only from one dashers perspective um, you in your particular market may not have experienced this. Uh, perhaps this could be some sort of a glitch or some kind of uh, new change they're going to be rolling out slowly. I don't know. Uh, this is the first I'm hearing of this. So this comes from Sam and he says, Hi Pete, it's Sam again. I was dashing the other night and did my first delivery. Completed it. And there was no running total on my screen. So I called and was told that it shows that I did complete the order and not to worry. And the totals will now be seen at the end of my dash. So now I have to end my dash to verify my total payments. What a crock of you know what. I'm wondering why they don't want me to see how much I'm making until the end. So now I guess I'll need to bring a notepad with me. Thanks, Sam. See, the fact that Sam even called to verify what's going on here, is this confirmed? I don't, I don't know because when you're talking to the reps on the phone, a lot of those people, like I've said, are, you know, in call centers they're reading verbatim off of a script and, you know, a lot of them might be green, you know, like brand new. Um, so with that being said, you can't always take the word of a, of a phone rep at DoorDash or any of these companies because their knowledge is very limited, especially to new changes and updates. However, if I had to theorize, if I had to give my opinion on this, uh, <laughs> You know, he's saying, wondering why they don't want me to see how much I'm making until the end. I think either maybe because customers are adjusting the tips, taking money away or something like that, or DoorDash maybe taking money. I don't know. I don't know. Please don't hold me to that because, again, I am not saying this is confirmed. But what I am saying is this clearly happened. Because to make something up like this is pretty radical, in my opinion. Just saying. So, again, something very, very sneaky is going on here. And I, I really hope somebody has some answers because that's ridiculous. That you have to end your dash to verify the total payments. What? Is, why? You know? It's just like these companies, I swear, man, they just keep tweaking things and changing things and forcing everybody to adapt to a, a a more stressful working environment. You know what I mean? Now, I know there's going to be people out there that are going to fight me tooth and nail and say, well, if you don't like it, go somewhere else. But the fact of the matter is this. A lot of people have, be, have gotten accustomed to working in the gig economy. They've been doing it for years, you know? Uh, and you know, the ability to set your own hours and to work when you want and to work where you want in many cases, you know, it's not so easy to just put this down and say, Oh, well, I'm going to give this up and go work a W2 tomorrow. You know what I mean? Where you have to now be somewhere at a certain time, have a boss, have a manager, you know, it's, it's not as easy to just throw this away like that, you know, but then again, complaining sometimes doesn't do anything anyway. So I, 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 I hear the argument on both sides, but drivers, dashers, firstly, question number one is, have you experienced this in your market and what market do you work in? Put that in the chat or the comments. And two, 
if you have any other information about this and have any confirmations or any emails or updates, definitely send it over to me and let me know in the comments or the chat down below what's going on. We definitely have to talk about this one. And of course, if you ever have anything you want to share with me, a comment, a question, a topic, a story, an article, whatever it is, be sure to send it to me at paid to drive stories at gmail.com. Also, for a quicker response, you guys can always reach out and message me through Patreon at patreon.com forward slash paid to drive. That link is in the description down below or in the pin top comment. And anyone who signs up as a patron as my way of saying thank you is I give you guys shout outs in all my new videos. And as you can see, there are all the names right here on your screen of our current patrons as of the current moment of this video being made. So huge shout outs to all of them. If you guys want to sign up, links are down below. As I mentioned, who's going to be the next patron? Maybe it will be you. And of course, I hope every single one of you out there is saving lots of money on your gas using the free gas app called Get Upside. The link is in the description down below. Just scroll down this page and click on the link that says Get the Free Gas App. It's very simple to use. It'll tell you how to install it on whatever kind of phone, tablet, or device that you have. And then from that point, all you got to do is go to your gas station, pump your gas, print out your receipt, take a picture of your receipt with the Get Upside Gas app, and within 48 hours or so, you'll get anywhere from 15 cents to 45 cents a gallon back, which is pretty fantastic. And if a friend or family member signs up using your code, you'll get paid every time they pump gas. It's called Get Upside. Links in the description down below. Make sure to download it today. And finally, for all your t-shirts, hoodies, and goodies, visit paidtodrivestore.com. That link is in the description, and you guessed it, the pinned top comment down below. We've got lots of great new designs, colors, sizes, you name it. We probably have it on sale every day at paidtodrivestore.com. That link is in the description down below. And the pin top comment. And of course, if you made it to the end of this video, I'm extremely grateful for all of you. Let me know by leaving a comment in the chat or the comment section below saying end 100, E-N-D 100. Just lets me know you did it. Don't forget to hit that red subscribe button down below and turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And if you wouldn't mind it, hit that like button down below. Just lets me know you enjoyed the video and it lets YouTube know that I'm doing a good job. In fact, leave a comment right now saying liked, L-I-K-E-D, just so I know you did it. And until next time, get that money, get that honey. Keep hustling and keep bustling. And we'll see you next time right here on Paid to Drive and Paid to Drive Logs. And as always, drive safe, be well, and we'll see you on the next one. Peace.